At the start of 2020, if somebody told you that a piece of paper that you could buy from an NPC for 200 coins will later be worth close to 30 million coins, you'd probably laugh at them. And that's for good reason. Something like that honestly just sounds too good to be true. But those people laughing would have actually been wrong. When we look at the stock of stones itself, realistically it doesn't really give us much information as to what it could ever do or if it will ever actually do anything. It tells us that it's a test item for the bazaar and was available from Warren for a limited time. It doesn't do anything for now but might be worth more in the future. Warning risky investment, this is a test item and may get deleted. But I don't want to take that for an answer. If we look at the lore of the Stock of Stonks, we can see the Stock of Stonks was originally sold by Warren for 200 coins. This item was intended to be valueless, to be used as a token simply to test if the bazaar was working as intended. Less than a day after its debut, Warren stopped selling stocks, because enough had been purchased to test the bazaar comfortably. Players quickly listed the stocks on the bazaar, and its price fluctuated wildly until it settled somewhere above its original cost price. During this time, Warren's GUI indicated that players would one day be able to sell stocks back to Warren. Warren was removed with the update on May the 19th, 2020, with the line in the changelog reading, Warren is going on a vacation for a long, long time. Over time, the stock's original purpose was forgotten, and players took time to think about the description of the item. Tempted by the potential of a hundred times riches, some players have hordes of stocks ready to be turned into something else, or sold back on the bazaar already over 43,000 times its original value. So from that, we know that the stock of stocks was a test item for the bazaar that is no longer obtainable. That explains why the stock of stocks continues to rise in price and doesn't really drop, because realistically, if you think about it, the supply is never going to increase, and the demand, well, I guess that's kind of subject to outside factors. Because the stock of stocks doesn't actually do anything, it's a little bit different to a regular item. For instance, if a weapon like the Hyperion is buffed, more people are going to want the Hyperion. Therefore, there's going to be more demand and the price is going to increase because more people are going to be willing to pay more coins for that weapon because it's better. This simply isn't the same element to something like the Stock of Stonks. And because of its finite supply, a steady increase in price makes sense. Well, two months ago, the Stock of Stonks was at around about 8 million coins and to be honest, everyone thought that was relatively expensive. Today, they're sitting at around about 23 mil, and yesterday, they were actually sitting at around about 28 mil. So the question begs, what on earth is going on with the stock of stonks? Well, before we get into that, if you are planning on purchasing anything from the Hypixel store, make sure to use code NITROS, it gets yourself 5% off. Damn! Also, you should subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you watch the videos and you haven't subscribed, then make sure to do so. And finally, you should join the Discord survey, it's linked in the description of this video. We offer slaves and dungeon carries, so if you need carries, or want to carry and make some coins, make sure to join. Imagine the amount of people in Skyblock who have not played the game for years, but they just have a ton of stock of stonks sitting there. Maybe in a chest, maybe in the backpack, or whatever. I bet the amount is ridiculous. Imagine the amount of people that had stockpiled stock of stonks but have been wiped or banned. Imagine what would happen if one very rich person decided to buy out the whole bazaar of stock of stonks. What the hell would happen then? If we look back six months, the stock of stonks was 5 million coins. A month later, at the end of August, Stock of Stonks was 6.5 million coins. A month later, at the end of September, Stock of Stonks was 7.5 million coins. Then a month later, they were 7.2. A month later, 8.2. A month later, 12.8. And yesterday, 30 million coins. Today, 23. What I'm trying to say is Stock of Stonks are just an incredibly safe investment. Now, there's people in real life that have a ton of money and they just invest that ton of money into a very, very safe stock or share and essentially just live off the interest. Obviously, this is not, I mean, it, it technically in the name is a stock, but it's not a typical stock. It's just an item that's very, very safe to invest in. But you can't help but feel the stock of stocks being this high, at some point it's going to come crashing down. And I am no closer to figuring out why the stock of stocks is so expensive. Now, I asked the question in my Discord server to see if there was any Brainiacs that could come up with a reasonable suggestion or explanation. Now, quite a few people said inflation, and you can't deny some of the some of the price of the stock of stocks must be attributed to inflation. However, like the exponential increase at the moment is not it's not relative. It is not it's not sort of in correlation with anything else on the market at the moment. Nothing else has increased that much in such a little period of time, which just kind of blows my mind. Limited stock, yeah, makes sense. SP players are dumb, and to be honest, that might just do it. Large amounts of players temp quitting and buying investments that have a good chance to pay off. 
Potentially, but what what has happened over the past like maybe week or few days that has caused this massive increase in people quitting the game? Anyone buying stock of stonks are buying them for an investment. There's no other reason to buy them. I don't know. Maybe maybe it is just straight up inflation, but I just I can't help but think that something else is going on with just the rate of increases. It's just crazy. Now, this is quite a big comment to read through, but essentially what it's saying in a lot of IRL trade deals, um, of, of course, coins are quite easily detectable. Um, so essentially, a lot of IRL traders will use stacks of stock of stonks um, instead of trading coins because it looks, I guess, somewhat less suspicious. So if potentially if there was a huge deal going down and a lot of stock of stonks were bought out, that would, of course, maybe explain the massive increase in price. I don't know if this is correct or not, but it's interesting to think about. I think this comment pretty much sums it up. This is in reply to another comment, basically talking about the price. I was under the impression um, that it was a gradual increase. Didn't know that it 2x in a week. If that happened, you're probably right about a lot being bought out at once to artificially rise the price. Now, this is really interesting. I kind of read this out before, but I just want to go back um, to, to the law. Um... And essentially what, what here, when actually, when Warren was basically removed from the game because his only purpose was to sell the stock of stonks, um, his kind of exit message alluded um, to him returning in the future uh, and being able to sell the stock of stonks um, back to Warren. Now, considering you could buy stock of stonks from Warren for 200 coins, how much is Warren buying these stock of stonks back for? Because looking at the current prices and um, what he would potentially probably buy them back for, I kind of feel like buying a stock of stonks is, even though it's steady and history has shown it to be a very safe investment, it seems at the same time that it's a, a bit of a risk considering um, all of the arrows point to it potentially being removed at any time. Kind of seems like a bit of a scam. Kind of seems like it's a bit of a safety net for the admins in case inflation ever gets out of hand. They can just simply pull the plug and delete loads of coins from the economy. The price could always continue to rise even further. And to be honest, at this point, who really knows how many of those are actually in circulation and how many of them are just sat in chess with people who don't play the game anymore. With the possibility of your millions or billions invested into stock of stonks turning to complete dust in an instance, almost feels like it's kind of the biggest scam ever. I don't know if they would ever literally just completely pull a plug on them, but I guess they could. I mean, it's quite literally the skyblock equivalent of crypto. Let me know in the comments what you think is going on with the stock of stonks. If you did enjoy today's video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next one.